Well, it was a deadly weekend on roads in northeast Montana as three separate accidents claim five lives, all in Roosevelt County. The first happened Friday evening when a box truck was traveling south on Road 1013 near U.S. Highway 2 and entered the railroad tracks. The truck was struck on the passenger side by an eastbound train. The force of the crash was so strong, parts of the truck were scattered in both the north side and south side ditches. Two men from Culbertson, an 18-year-old and a 21-year-old, were partially ejected and pronounced dead on scene. We're told they were both wearing seat belts and alcohol and speed are not suspected factors. The second crash happened west of Culbertson on BIA Route 1 Saturday afternoon. According to the Highway Patrol, a 2009 Chevy Traverse was traveling east when the driver attempted to pass another vehicle and swerved to the right to avoid an oncoming car, hit a highway entrance, rolling two times and coming to arrest. All three occupants were ejected. A 66-year-old man was transported to Roosevelt Memorial Medical Center in Culbertson with injuries. The driver and another passenger, a 41-year-old female and a 50-year-old female, died at the scene. The investigation revealed seatbelts were not being used and speed and alcohol are suspected factors. The third crash happened west of Poplar on BIA Route 1. A 22-year-old man was traveling east in a 2013 Chevy Cruze when he he veered right and went 400 feet along the ditch before hitting a metal culvert, which sent the vehicle flying 187 feet. It then rolled multiple times before striking a wooden pole and coming to rest on the roof. The driver was not wearing a seat belt and both alcohol and speed are suspected as factors. Road conditions were reported as wet. According to the Montana Highway Patrol, this brings the total number of fatalities on Montana roads for the year to 114.